Hey. Howdy folks! Hey. How's it going? Welcome to my Virgin Kitchen, it's Barry here and today I'm Where joined with Phoebe. Hello. Hello, it's my oldest daughter Phoebe and her monkey. Say hello monkey. Hello. Uh, it's Food Revolution Day, hashtag uh, FRD 2014 on the 16th of May. It's all about cooking with kids, right? Yeah. And uh, yeah, so I do a lot of cooking with my girls and uh, we're going to show you how to make some... Better not squash muffins. Yes, we are. Right here then folks, so for this recipe uh, you need the following ingredients. Phoebs, tell people to hit pause. Hit pause. Great, okay, so hit pause, write those ingredients down. You need a massive blender thing, we don't have one of those, so what we have got is a grater and a kid with some elbow grease, right? Do you know what elbow grease is? No. Okay, you're going to find out. Uh, what other ingredients have we got, mate? we got a butternut squash. Yeah. Salt, yeah. sugar, plain flour, olive oil and eggs. Yeah, what are these things? Come on. Fair. Whoa, 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 whoa. Walnuts. Walnuts, give me some skin. Let's get going, yeah? Yeah. Good. Right then folks, I've got myself a knife here. I'm just going to cut off the nipply bit of our butternut squash and then the neck and then the bum bit. The bum we don't need for this recipe. We only need 200 grams, which is definitely the neck bit there. So if I just cut that bit off, it's quite tough. Boom. Can you grate that up for me, mate? What, you, from that side? Just any side you want, mate, because apparently the skin is just as good as which the middle side bit. Side? This bit, right there. Hold it down, like this, go. All right, so just for health and safety, I'm helping Phoebe great away, so that if anything, ow, she slams my fingers on the board and cuts my fingers off. Ah! So our butternut squash is all done, and what we're gonna do now, we've just realized, again, with the blender steps, um, you would normally whiz up the walnuts and they'd be all chopped for you. So if you've got a blender, this recipe is super easy, so we're doing it a bit more manual. Uh, Phoebe is putting in the walnuts, right? Yeah. And what are you gonna do to them? I'm going to put them into the bag, stick yeah. them and mash them up. Mash them? You mean bash them? Yeah. I want you to go crazy. I want you to make a crazy fashion face. Go for it. Mm. <laughs> right. <laughs> Did you enjoy that? Yeah. Bit of stress relief. Uh, Phoebe's an expert at that. Um, you've got to watch your fingers when you do that. She's been doing this for years. So uh, walnuts are nice and bashed up, There's right mate? one that isn't bashed up a bit. Well, you know what you've got to do there, mate. Bash it. Go for it. She's enjoying that. Get off the sugar. <laughs> right, are you ready? Yeah. Right, I'm giving Phoebe a gigantic bowl uh, just for, to stop any spillage because it just could get anywhere. Massive red spatula. First of all, she's going to crack eggs in there. You want to do it, mate? Yeah. She could do this when she was one. And now she's how old are you? Five. Five, and you're nearly six, right? No, sh no shell. Good skills, mate. Right, so the cool thing is now with the eggs in there, that's probably the most trickiest bit really. Uh, the sugar goes in, uh, the squash, the flour, everything gets combined in there. Easy peasy. Yeah. Yeah. That's just a pinch of salt, mate, okay? Yes, good skills. Don't put the whole load in, that might be a bit uh, tangy then. What's that? Um, cinnamon. Cinnamon. What's that one? Um, I don't know. It's baking powder. Baking powder. Yes, mate. That is coming together. Good colour scheme going on. I like it. Uh, what about the olive oil? Can you reach for that? Yes. All of it. Yeah. Do you want to drink it? No. Good. Yes, mate. That's squash. Yeah, baby. Do you want some help? No. No. Independent woman. Here she goes. Yes. So before you mix it, have you got anything to say? No. <laughs> Get in there then. Go for it. Yes, mate. Good skills, mate. Keep that going. Yes. Daddy, we need the walnuts now. Walnuts? There you go. Can't believe we've got the walnuts. Get them in, Basher. Ah, oh, that's looking amazing, mate. What do you think that looks like? Um, poo. Looks like poo? Yeah. Well, if it is poo, it's a tasty poo. Guys, I just put the cupcakes in there. That's right, mate. You are putting the cupcakes in. And while Phoebe's doing that, I went and did the adult step of preheating the oven to gas mark four or equivalent. And then she gets the fun step now. What are we going to do? We're going to put all the mixture, what we made, into the cupcakes. Yes, we are. So let's do it, yeah? Yeah. Cool. I say both of us can do it, but it looks like Phoebe is taking well charge of this step. Right, mate? Yes. Can I help you? No. Okay. That's fine. <laughs> I'm going to cry. So seeing as you're doing this step all by yourself, have you got any tips? No. No? What if people want to do it? What if other kids want to do it and you're trying to show them? 
You have to get two spoons. Yeah. With one of the spoons, you scoop some up. Okay. Put it in a cupcake. Yeah. And then go like that. That's if amazing. If Is it hard? No. Okay. Well, just you just do those steps then. Wow, you look happy with yourself. Yeah. Check those out. Are you good? Are you happy about it? You excited? Yeah. I'm going to give you 10 out of 10 for that, mate. Let me just mop up a little bit of that mess and then we'll plonk them in the oven, yeah? Yes. Good times. Can you say good times? Good times. You've got it on your t-shirt as well. Thanks. Right, folks, these are, now, <laughs> these are now going in the oven until they're nice and cooked through. We're going to put a cocktail skewer through them to make sure that they are not messy and mushy, right? Yeah. Yeah. And then, I uh, do that. Yeah, of course you can. Good times. Daddy, you do the icing and I do some reading. Okay, so while they're baking away, we're gonna quickly make our icing. This is, I'm gonna go approximate here, about 90 mils of sour cream. This is two tablespoons of icing sugar. We'll grate on half a lemon zest and half an orange zest as well. Look at that color, amazing. Yeah, so all I've done is mix that through. So we'll whack it in the fridge to keep it nice and cool. When Phoebe's cupcakes are done, she'll spread them on top. Oi! <laughs> um, Phoebe has not doubled in height, she's stood on a chair. We've just taken these out of the oven and you've got a bamboo skewer there. So if they're gooey, we're going to put them back in the oven again. If not, we're going to let them cool, right? So uh, skewer away. Let's have a little look. Let everyone know. <gasps> okay, careful, careful, careful. Yes. Yeah, it's clean. Look at the camera and say, it's clean. clean. Yeah, it's clean. Right, little Chloe is out playing there, but meanwhile, big Phoebe, doosh, what are you doing, mate? I'm putting all the icing on, and then I'm going to sprinkle the orange leftovers on the um, lemon leftovers. Amazing, yeah, just to let you know, guys, these cakes are fully cooled down. If that icing was, you know, still as thin as it was, it is quite a thin icing, and those cakes are warm, what will happen, mate? They'll all drip off. It will drip off, yeah. So as you can see, it's holding nicely. Or if you want, you could thicken it up with some more icing sugar. And as Phoebe says, you've got the zest there just to sprinkle on top. Happy, mate? Yeah. How happy are you on a scale of one to... I'm happy. Okay. Phoebe, you've done an amazing job putting the zest on those. Are you happy? Yeah. Have you got a message for all the kids in the world about cooking? What yes. would you say cooking is? Cooking is fun. Is it? Yeah. Because it is fun, isn't it? Me and you have made so many memories together doing videos, haven't we? Yeah. Do you get Do you cry sometimes late at night? Do you get all upset? No. It's fine, guys. So, uh, look, if she can make that, anyone can. Oh, my goodness, guys. These taste amazing. Do you like them? Yes. And some skin. She made those. Cooking is fun. Cooking with kids is about making memories. Get involved in Food Revolution Day. Hashtag FRD2014. You like it, Chloe? Is that nice? Can I have a thumbs up? Yes. Thumbs up, guys. If you enjoyed this video... Yeah, don't forget to give it a thumbs up, share, subscribe, comment, check out Food Revolution Day, as I say. We'll see you again next time. Bye! Bye!